first swing sets the pace for the rest of the day. This is going right down the middle, I feel it. Purple power, I got my purple shirt on. Oh, look at that, right down the middle. That's gonna be a good day. All right, see where this one goes. That's right down the middle again. All right, I don't think I should warm up anymore. I wanna save these for the golf course. Okay, today is the day, our 14th annual uh, golf tournament for the Children's Hospital at Albany Medical Center. And I am excited because we are going over a big mile mark of a goal of $300,000 in uh, proceeds that we've been able to give to the Children's Hospital. So that's a big number. Our, our original goal was to get up to 100,000, we thought that was a big number, and each and every year it got bigger and bigger, and um, more and more people came out to the events, more sponsors came to the events, and uh, it's just been a great cause. So this year is actually a little different. This year, uh, I'm gonna actually not golf in my foursome, which I, uh, you know, I love golfing with uh, the foursomes that I've had over the years, but uh, this year I wanted to get out there and, and thank everyone for coming and for helping us uh, you know, reach that $300,000 mark this year is very exciting. So I look forward to it because this is an event that uh, I feel is, it's got a lot of emotions to it. I mean, I remember my kids uh, were in the Children's Hospital when they were younger and uh, they do so much for our community. They do so much for uh, the children. They do so much for families. And uh, we want to just keep giving to them each and every year. And this is our biggest, by far our biggest event each and every year that we do. This golf event is something I think a lot of people, not only myself, but also our team, our staff, our clients, our vendors, uh, all enjoy as well and they look forward to it every year. So we are here today to meet uh, Mike Baker from Real Producer Magazine here in the Albany uh, area. He's promoting the uh, golf tournament for us this year. Absolutely. Uh, when I first heard about the charity tournament, I was really excited to check it out. I'm glad I did last year because yeah. it's just an amazing story. And, and if we can help inspire other people to do great things like you, then that's what I'm all about. It's always important to have the right golf shoes. Now they're blue, match, uh, they match Allstate, and also they match uh, Miranda Blue. And uh, they got these special cleats I hit the ball farther. The hackers are all pulling up. Oh, here's one right here. Appreciate you guys coming out. Sunmark's always been a great supporter of this event, great sponsor. They've always, uh, anything we need, they've always been there to help. So thank you guys so much for coming out. Is this your first time out? Yep. This event? Yep, first time okay. the event. All right, good. Yeah. My best friend from how far back we go? Three years old. Three years old. Right here, Mr. Mikey Debrino. Hits our first golf shot each and every year. The first pitch, we have the first drive. And last year, I think he topped it. You know, if he does it again this year, I don't know, we might have to uh, seek out a new uh, first, first tee off uh, person that can actually hit the ball. But uh, we'll see how he does this year, and, and I'm sure he's gonna do a great job. And then after that, we're gonna have uh, basically best ball uh, for 18 holes. Everyone has a good time with that. It moves the play a lot quicker. And I'm uh, looking forward to being able to actually go out, meet everyone. And actually I'm gonna be maybe a fifth shot for everyone and uh, pick up the club and see where they're at at that point. And who knows, maybe, uh, maybe I can give them a better angle in at the green, uh, maybe save them a shot or two. But uh, I'm gonna be doing that as well so I can still get some golf but still be able to socialize and, and meet people. All right, thank you everyone for coming out. Um, weather today, the plan is uh, it's gonna stay out and uh, we're gonna be able to get our 18 holes in. But if not, uh, we're gonna have to start cocktail a little early. You guys okay with that? Yeah. 
I didn't think anyone would mind. Um, so I just want to say thank you so much. And we have Melanie here from Searcy that's going to be singing our national anthem. Melanie? Thank you. Hi, everybody. Whatever it works, boom. Boom! Hey, you know what? As long as it goes in, who cares, she right? Both of our putts. Today, Christine starts her first job. Actually, I gotta send her a video. She started her first day in her new, uh, her new career. Ah, I did that yesterday. I don't like that ball anyway. <laughs> Boom. Boom. There it is. I got this orange ball because I lost all the white ones on my drives. <laughs> it's terrible. Think I'm on the fairway? Oh, yeah. yeah. Where do you think you missed a left? Maybe. The thing was moving that way, but wow! Imagine that. Be awesome. At least you got. At least I have three witnesses. I got witnesses on camera. And it's on camera, right? I think we got it down. The orange ball and the blue tee is the key to success for the long drive. Let's go see where it went. Maybe I got the longest drive. Got to got to go see if I had the longest drive in my own tournament. It's off. Oh, well, we'll see. We'll see if it's on the fairway. I don't see it. Would a chipmunk pick it up? Where is it? Oh, it's over here. Wow. I don't think I've ever driven the ball this far. All right, so the men's longest drive so far is way over there. Elizabeth, can you see it? Way down there? Yeah. Way down there. And that was Alan Boulant. And I hit that ball at least, ah, oh, geez, I don't know, maybe 75, 100 over to here. So the fact that I'm off the rough or off the fairway and onto the rough uh, doesn't count. It's my tournament. I won't let it count. But I just wanted to make the record known that uh, Alan got swamped on his uh, drive on that. I just beamed it 53 yards. 53 yards? There you go. 75, 100 over to here. So <laughs> Too bad it was off the fairway. Rough. You're, you're off the road? Yeah. The Is he still holding? Uh, yeah, yeah, you're still holding. Bye. -bye. <laughs> Thanks for coming out. Appreciate it. Yeah. We've been coming for a while. Yeah. yeah. There you go. <laughs> oh, okay. So you raised a lot of money on her? Yeah, I'm raising a ton of money. All right. Good job. Thanks, Bob. See ya. That one. Thank you. Hi, right, Vince. How you doing? How you doing? Nice to meet you, Vince.
How you doing? Adam. Adam. This is Adam. Adam. Nice to meet you. My buddy Mark. Willie hey, Miranda. Mark. Good to meet you, man. The man, the myth, the legend. Yes, yeah. yes. Now you're the legend. <laughs> You've been around. Not, not today, my friend. How you doing? Uh -oh. Thanks for coming out. Not today. You know, I'm meeting people I've never met before. I've come to our tournaments in the past. Usually I only get to see him at dinner and uh, get to see him, you know, as all that chaos is going on. So to be able to come out here and uh, play a little golf with them, have a good time is, is definitely a lot more fun than playing in it. Christine, your daughter, uh, years back, she wanted to help out with the charity, uh, hadn't taken part in things, and um, she came up with a great idea, we give her all the credit, of a car wash. And I remember it was a rainy day, yeah. we are like, oh, you know, we try to get it some volunteers, and you know, she had some friends in school, and I think that first year we still generated like over 700, close to $1,000 right. on it. So like, this might work. It became uh, competitive between our offices. Each year, it went back and forth, which office, would generate the most money. We're averaging almost three thousand dollars, you know, right. on a single Saturday afternoon car yeah. wash. Uh, that all started with a great idea from Christine. So uh, I know we also just got a grant uh, from one of our corporate sponsors, Allstate, uh, for five thousand dollars just for the car wash. So it just keeps building every year. Yeah, for so many years, you know, we just started it where our goal was just to raise, say, a hundred thousand dollars. And then as the years went on and the tournaments went on, it got bigger and bigger. Uh, we've had more corporate sponsors these last few years. Uh, to where now we're doing thirty, forty thousand dollars a year. So uh, we did set up a 5013C, a non-for-profit organization uh, under the Miranda Charity Corp, which uh, I feel is just uh, one step uh, closer for us to even get uh, more donation from bigger yeah. corporate sponsors yeah, here. Yeah, a lot of people want to get involved and help, so having that is definitely going to help. But we also got to mention, through the years, we've been very fortunate to have great committee members to help organize this. Yeah, and I just think it's fun. You know, playing golf yeah. is fun, especially on a beautiful day like this. face and look at <laughs> oh I made that putt. Look at the, look look so at the it was like a plastic thing. Sure, it's such a great cause. When you started doing this 14 years ago, we were thrilled to be a part of it. We again, we've donated every single year uh, to give back to the the local children of this hospital. Is just an incredible opportunity for us, and Sunmark's proud to be a, a titanium sponsor this year. Yes, absolutely. Thanks for being a sponsor oh once again and You're helping welcome. us out. I mean, well, we'll do it again next I, year. I think we had another great year this year, and absolutely. actually. Uh, we had a lot of uh, sponsors that uh, we didn't get last year too. Is that right? So, and I know you did the video, so that helped out a lot too. So, well, yeah, well, and hopefully, kinda, hopefully, kinda, you guys want a little money here. I don't know, but hopefully, but uh, if, we're, if we did, we're gonna we're gonna pass it on. Oh, to the chair. Appreciate it. Yeah. Thanks, man. Thank you. All right, but I talked to you. It. And then lastly, I want to point out Carol Steven uh, actually did a, a, a titanium sponsor this year in memory of a very good friend of ours. Remember of a very good friend of ours. You guys look over here to the chart here is our, our good friend, John. Unfortunately, lost John this year. Oh. Sorry. I'm coming up. I'm not saying nothing. You're sorry. <laughs> <laughs> uh, All right. What can we say? He's a brother, you know, and we love golf. Um, we love Tina. Everyone loves Tina dearly. But this tournament was a big deal for him, and I know he's here with us in spirit today. And uh, I know one of the last conversations we had, we were golf or texting about the uh, the Masters and yeah. Tiger making yeah. a comeback. You know, so he was always an avid golf fan, and I want to thank Carol uh, for stepping up and making a huge donation in his name. You know, I've said it before. You guys remember. Uh, if you guys have been here for the first time, I mean, we do this each and every year. We started it 14 years ago. A lot of it was based on, uh, you know, just some of my own experiences at the Children's Hospital and what they did for my, both of my daughters early on and also just in the last recent uh, few years. Uh, they're just a great organization and uh, something that uh, we felt very comfortable and wanted to give back to them. Um, as Rich said, we're the only NICU for the only childhood cancer program and we're the only um, we're the only children's hospital in the whole region. And while we're the only, we're also the best. And that's thanks to our community support like yours. It's my pleasure to introduce to you today um, a very, very special family to us. This is Logan Fogg. He's two years old. Um, he's our 2019 Children's Hospital Champion. So 
what I love most about um, Albany Med and the Medi Med Melody Center is the doctors listen. So the doctors always would say, you know, I think this, and I would say, I don't agree. And two weeks later, they would come back to me and be like, okay, I trust you, you trust your mommy gut. So that's the one thing I absolutely love about Albany Medical Center because they're, the staff is so, they're so smart, obviously, but they also listen to you. Um, so it's a great family and, and I appreciate all your support and all your help and without these donations, um, Logan wouldn't be here today, so thank you. 2019 Miranda Charity Golf Tournament Champions with a score of 60, our first place team, Joe DiLorenzo, John Longo, Ross Lackey, and RJ Gallup. Gentlemen, congratulations. Okay, we're really excited. The final numbers are in for our 14th annual golf event. Trish, tell us why. Yes, well, a special shout out to all the players who played in the tournament, all the people who attended the dinner, anyone who donated um, raffle items or sponsored our event. We couldn't do without all of your support and all of your help. So thank you so much. So last year I told you we were at 291,000, just over 291,000. Uh, and this year, Tina, what did we add to the to the mix? We ended up raising over thirty-five thousand dollars this year, and that put us to a grand total of three hundred and twenty-six thousand three hundred and thirty-one dollars. Awesome! So thank you so much for everyone, as Trish said, our our golfers, sponsors, and everyone that has helped. And looking forward to seeing you on our fifteenth annual golf event. Thank you.